So in the last example, we had a nice, easy division without any standoff. So now let's look at another version that's slightly different. Some of the evaluations have changed here. So Abby's declaration now is piece 2 and piece 4. Brian's is piece 2 and piece 4. Uh, Chris's declaration is going to be only piece 2. And of course, Dorian uh, values all of them equally. So let's see. Uh oh. So we have a problem here. We have a standoff uh, between the uh, these three players where they all value piece 2 and piece 4. Well, Chris only piece 2, but nonetheless, we still have a standoff. And so because of this, uh, the only piece that nobody cares about, apparently, is piece 3. And so piece 3 is going to get awarded to Dorian. And the other three, the rest of the content, other than piece 3, is going to get reassembled, assembled, and they're going to start the whole process over with a new divider. Uh, and so we need to know, uh, what the resulting, uh, values look like then. So here's their valuations for the new division. Again, the idea here is that originally, uh, Dorian had divided the land up into, let's say, four pieces. Uh, piece 1, piece 2, piece 3, and piece 4. Uh, and nobody, the, the, so piece 3 got awarded, but not the rest of it. And so the rest of that land, so I'm going to sort of try to draw this in here. The rest of that land, pardon my bad drawing, would get reassembled. And in this case, Brian was chosen as the new divider. Uh, and Brian then divides this up into, uh, differently. Let's say maybe like this. And so here's our new piece 1, piece 2, and piece 3. So now we're div t totally new division. And now we can work off of here. So here, the declarations from Abby will be, uh, p just piece 1. Remember, now a fair share is 33%. Uh, Chris's declaration is going to be, only piece 1. Uh, and so once again, we have a standoff, uh, but piece 2 and piece 3 are both uncontested. And so again, we'd flip a coin, and one of those pieces would go to, uh, go to, to Brian. So let's say maybe player piece 3 here goes to, goes to Brian. So then player 1, uh, sorry, Abby and Chris then will recombine the remaining piece parts here, undo that, and they will use basic divider chooser now. So Abby and Chris will use basic divider chooser to split up what's left. Uh, now notice both of them value what's left here at, let's see, 40 and 30, 70 percent, 30 and tw 50 and 20 is, uh, also 70 percent. So both of them are going to get half of that, 35 percent. So both of them are going to end up with something that they value as a fair share. So maybe just to see, imagine how this could go down. So Abby and Chris are dividing this. Maybe this time Chris is the divider. So Chris divides this up maybe here into two new pieces. Abby chooses this one. Chris gets the other one. And now we finally have a fair division. Uh, in this case, we had to reuse loan divider twice and then resolve the standoff between two players, the divider chooser. And so this was a more complicated version of, of loan divider.